Hey guys, before we start today's video, be sure to tick that subscribe button and be sure to prod the bell icon for more content straight into your YouTube feed. Welcome one and all to a brand new video, where today we'll be ranking the best versions of the most well-known zombies map in history, Darice. Be sure to let me know in the comments section what your favorite version of Darice is and why. And without further ado, let's begin. Hello there guys, so the first map we're going to be playing on our ranking journey of Darice is World at War. I mean, where else are we going to start? So let's just hop into the Darice on World at War. Now guys, what would you personally think of Darice World at War? Like, let me know in the comments. Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the comments. Dom 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 let me know in the comments section what you think of World at War Darice. I, I swear, I feel like my. Why do I keep throwing grenades? Stop throwing grenades, goddammit! Um. Uh. Huh. Right, okay. Actually, what happened just there actually proves one of my uh, criticisms about this map and maybe this game. When zombies hit you, it's like. It's like you're automatically just magnetized them and they start just windmilling you. That's one of the reasons why one of my main qualms about this game and its version of Darice is that the zombies themselves are... And one thing you can't never, ever go wrong with in this game is its weapon selections. Holy Jesus. Right, first missed you by the box. What you do is you, you knife, you shoot each corner, you crouch. Eh, can't get up. Eh, I'm, I'm stuck. Eh, I'm stuck. There we go. Okay, we crouch. We open the box and then we get ray gun. Shoot again, spin around. Crap. Give me that. Give me that. This thing is beautiful. Listen to that. Listen to that um, PPSH. Listen to it. In all of its glory. Oh, it's your most beautiful little shang. It is your most beautiful little pip. <laughs> oh, it's just so nice to hold this thing. Oh, it's just beautiful. But guys, let me know down in the comment section what you think of World at War. Honestly, you know, it's a great map to revisit every so often, you know. It's, in this, it's got nostalgia written all over it. It has some of the best weapon selection out of the entire Call of Duty series. But if I'm gonna be honest, and what I'm gonna rate this out of 10. Oh yeah, just saying we're doing a, 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 a 10 rating system here. Yeah. So yeah guys, overall I would rate World of War to be a, you know, it's a nostalgic classic. Everyone loves World of War, everyone remembers World of War for its amazing gameplay, but I would honestly rate this game a, a solid 6 out of 10. But anyway, without further ado, let's hop straight into the next series on this list. No power, weak. Right, we are back on Black Ops 1. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> knifing's a lot better in this game. Jesus, I think honestly they perfect the knifing so well in this game. Knifing's a lot better in this game. What the? F what was that? What, what was that? What is with round three? My God. Let's try that again then, shall we? Trigger finger activated. Oh, Jesus Christ. I think I feel a headshot. Uh, oh, yeah, 100% E. Ooh. Ooh. Eh, I'll take it. I'm going to rip shit up. Yeah. 
Wait, what was that? Is that leading? Wait, is that leading in this game? What? There's leading in this game? Ten years. This game's been out for ten years and there was leading in this game? That is mad. Wait. <laughs> Wait just a second. What? There's leading? Nah. Wait a minute. There's no way. What? Wait. What? You, you can... I'm, <laughs> I'm dancing. Wait a minute. If this is what I think it is. <gasps> Rainbow Six Siege. Copied Black Ops 1. Confirmed. Ooh. That's what I need. More fucking firepower. Alright then, guys. So this was Black Ops 1. Darius. I mean, is 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 one of, if not the best version of Darius that is currently out on Treyarch's official games. One of the better gameplays. It, it, it's basically fixed all the issues that World at War had. But the only thing that does make it a bit iffy for me uh, is the fact that the gun roster in this game are uh, it's not the uh, not the most fantastic little thing, but it's always nostalgia to always hold like the RPK. But uh, in all honesty, I would rate this game a solid 8. No, 10. Because it's just so fantastic to play. It's so nostalgic. I mean, the Wonder Wolf is bloody gold. Like, but without further ado, let's just uh, hop into the last and final official Darius map. All right, now we're on a final. Oh, 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 whoa, okie dokie then. But anyway, we're on our final map of today which is the giant on Black Ops 3. Now, I actually quite enjoy this map. I'm not gonna lie to you, I've always kind of had a bit of a, uh, a displeasing look on this thing, but honestly, I, I, I like this map. You gotta appreciate the colors and the map design of this, honestly. You know, look, like coming back to it now after so long, you really do appreciate like the color of that, the, the teleporter, the snow, like it looks absolutely fantastic. Oh, oh, eh. Okay, this is by far the best looking and just most powerful Wonder Wolf in any of the Black Ops games. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my god. <laughs> Two more. One more. The madness of these machines remain. <laughs> right, so we go to reverse psychology. So, uh, ask for something else. So give me the, uh, give me the, the rocket launcher. Give me the rocket launcher. Give me the rocket launcher. Give me the rocket launcher. Now, nah, now nah, it gives me the rocket launcher. Bloody hell! Oh wait a minute, I just realized something. <laughs> Yeah. Oh. Little shit. Little shit. Little shit. Press big friendly button. Perkazid. Yes. Oh, wait, I can't buy it. Wants to buy basic. So that's it. This is the giant from Black Ops 3. Honestly, I replaying it now. I do actually thoroughly, thoroughly, thoroughly enjoy the map, and I, it kind of, it's, it's actually rekindled why, I, why I actually loved it in the first place. Really, I mean, in the past, it's been like, oh, I'm not a big fan of the giant, but to be honest, to be honest with you. Um, this is a good map. It's, 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 it did a good job. I can see why. You know, it rekindled the entire zombies community alongside Shadows of Evil. You know, the guns are good. The map designs are fantastic. The gameplay is unbelievable. So I'm going to give this a 9 out of 10. But yeah, that was Black Ops 3's The Giant. That is every Darius map ranked. Let me know your ranking in the comment section below. During this video, I was able to get a much clearer look at what makes each map special, like World at War with its weapons, Black Ops 1 with its difficulty, and BO3 with its overall gameplay and ability to cater to newer players. But that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed, be sure to join the Discord in the description for more shenanigans. And if you want more videos like this, be sure to leave a like and subscribe with the bells on. But you don't have to. It's a free world for crying out loud. Without further ado, 
I'll see you next time. Cheerio.